Have you guys thought of doing something with that guy, Scotty Bowers? Scotty was a revelation. Scotty is a phenomenon, legend. He serviced a lot of people. That's what you call business, baby. <laughs> People are very invested in the establishment view of movie star history. The strict moral code that we associate with Hollywood was a very traditional viewpoint. The movie stars were just good, honest, law-abiding citizens. It turned out there was a whole alternate world to which most of us had no access or knowledge. Scotty Bauer he had this gas station and he supplied men and women to the various Hollywood stars. People disappearing up in the trailer and doing this and that, the whole thing was fun. <laughs> People wanted something, Scotty would get it. Cole Porter would say, can you bring 15 guys one right after the other? I fixed Catherine Hepburn up with every bit of 150 girls. I've been with Barry Grant Luck at some Charles Lawton at Frank Sinatra's house. I had a three-way with Ava Gardner and Lana Turner. There was a whole network of folks waiting for someone like Scotty to come along. He wasn't simply this madam called for events. Scotty's revealing that these people were real, flesh and blood like us. It can add up to an awful lot of people, into the thousands. I didn't know him then. I don't know him as that person. Not sure I want to. <laughs> <laughs> I went in the Marine Corps in World War II. Scotty was in horrific battles. In Iwo Jima, we had 7,000 guys killed. It made me happy to be alive. He's warm, he's caring. He likes to make people happy. The world was different then. If it became public that you were gay, you would be immediately fired. They could go to jail. Scotty was able to allow these people to have lives. Dr. Kinsey interviewed me, saying, you ever had sex with a girl? Yes. How about with a guy? Yes. Would you do everything? But somebody's square saying, you're weird, you're different. <laughs> I did the book to show that people are still people. Don't you think you misled their trust by writing a tell-all book? What's wrong with being gay? But thanks anyhow. We are now embracing where the motto is, do your own thing. Scotty was doing that when it was not culturally acceptable. If it wasn't for this guy, I would have sank. I often think back of how nice things were. I felt good that I made so many people happy. <laughs>